Good morning, Thompson students. In about an hour, you and I are going to be together in the classroom. But I wanted to do something a little bit different on the last week of school. So, welcome hey. to my home. And welcome to our backyard. Yeah. I got okay. Katie with me. Can you say good morning? Good morning. <laughs> And today, we are gonna show you guys what we stumbled upon over the weekend. If you look here, we have some crab apple trees, all right? Up in the crab apple trees, we have recently discovered eastern tent caterpillars, which turn into the basic brown moths that you guys probably see floating all over the place, but never really knew where they came from. Well, they do something pretty cool. They make these huge cocoons that are almost like a jawbreaker on the inside. You want to ask them something? Okay, go ahead, so, quickly. Like this on the ground is dew. And that's how they make their houses. But they ha make their house is, they make their house, they have to poop it out to make the house. <laughs> Close. They actually spin spinners. So it's like all this silk stuff, the stuff that you guys love to wear, right? The soft fabric. Oh, yeah. They spin these spinnerets and create these silk kind of cocoons. So what we're gonna do is actually look in this tree real quick so you guys can see. Now, there's one, yeah. and back over here is another. And if you look even closer, you'll notice that there's caterpillars inside. So what we're gonna do is grab a couple for you, and we're gonna bring you the Eastern Tent Caterpillar. There is one right there, and he's coming to your guys' classroom. Katie, go right on ahead. You wanna take him? show what I'm gonna do. So I have this bucket, water bu watermelon seeds thing, and I'm gonna grab it, and there we go. There we There's go, one. right in there. All right, let's get a couple more, because yeah. I know these guys will really like that. Can you hold on to these leaves? Don't put them in there yet. These leaves they eat off of, and the reason why we decided to grab some of these for you guys, rather than the monarch butterflies, which honestly we haven't found yet, is because these guys are the beast of the caterpillar world. Now I know it kind of sounds silly to think that, but it really is true. These guys can devour this whole entire tree and when their parents lay the eggs that causes them to hatch, it's like 200 to 350 eggs at a time. All right, looks like my kiddo got to these before I did and they tried to bring probably about 500 of them home yesterday. Oh, there's one there. So let's just grab that one. All right, now we got you two. We're just looking carefully for more caterpillars. And they have four at the hash right now. Yeah, Katie has her own. Okay, let's go over to another tree that has them. But we kind of got to go quickly because we got to get in the car. We have school to go to. All right, it's really cool out here, like I said. There's a lot of rich history, which we're going to help discover with you guys all over the summer. And just so you guys know, we're going to try to do this daily. <laughs> Katie has been wanting to do um, videos for a long time. Okay, here is a better nest that you can really see in bloom. And I'm sorry if I'm making you guys seasick as I'm walking around, I'm just trying to go fast. You can tell the spinner part, the silk strands that she's talking about, see how they line the tree? That's yeah. their communication pattern. It's like their roads. So what we're gonna do is just get a couple more for you here. Here, Kay. Take this little guy. Come on, buddy, you're going to Juliet. And maybe this one here. Land on the back. There we go. Say hi. All right, we got four. Four is a pretty good number. They'll work in teams that way. Okay, and then we've also got One more. maybe a bigger stick that we can take and put in there. And then again, I'm just trying to get some of the stuff. As you can tell, these limbs have been devoured. I told you guys, they're the beast of the caterpillar world for a reason. These limbs over here are holding up pretty strong, so I think we'll snatch one of those and look. Look what I found on one of them. Another caterpillar coming to you guys. All right, Katie, you wanna put the box below that one so it doesn't fall? No, 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 you see it? It's right here. Okay, we'll take him leaf and all. Okay, and then since he liked that branch, the branch comes with us too, and that'll go in the car. All right, so again, let me see if I can flip this around real quick. There's Katie. Say, I'm Katie, I'm signing out. Say bye, see you guys later, huh? All right, you guys know me all too well. I'll see Mama, you guys in the classroom. Mom. Be sweet. What? Um, oh, the caterpillars want to say something. Bye. I love you. And I'll see you in Delia. All right. Peace out, you guys. See you soon.